Hi, I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw an explorer's ship. We're going to start at the bottom over here on the side and put a dot. And from that dot, I am going to draw curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line. I come over on the left, put two fingers in a dot. Over on the right, put two fingers in a dot. Go back to the left. I'm going to, going to draw a curve line down, connect, straight line over, straight line down, curve line, straight line up, down, curve line, connect. I come to the center and I draw one, two, three, four, five curve lines. And I go on the left and draw one, two, three squares. On the right, one, two, three squares. I draw a straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line, straight line. And now I'm going to add a little perpendicular line to give the illusion that this is a wooden ship. Right here in the center, I'm going to draw a big curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. I'm going to draw a smaller one, curve line underneath, and a smaller one, curve line on the top. On the left hand side, I'm going to draw a triangle, and on the right hand side, I'm going to draw another triangle. I go back to the left and add little straight lines, center, coming down. And right here at the bottom, I'm going to draw a straight line across, straight line across, and put some little straight lines in between. I go back to the top and add straight line, straight line, straight line. And then I go wavy, wavy line up, wavy line connect, wavy, wavy line up, wavy line connect, wavy wavy line up, wavy line connect. I come back in and I put some little straight lines at the base of each one of my sails. And now I am ready to color. First I'm going to add my water so I take my blue marker and I go curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line. I take my red and I'm going to use that on my flags. And I'm using markers so that the color really pops. So I'll be doing that with red, but you can use any color you want. Then I'm going to come in and do my little windows green marker. I'm going to use brown crayon to do the bulk of my ship. And finally, I'm going to add some yellow straight lines in the background just to give it a little bit more color. When you do this, make sure you emphasize to the children not to draw through their drawing and to make sure that their lines go all the way to the top of the picture and all the way down on the sides. Here's my ship all colored in, ready to explore the new world or places unknown. Okay, bye bye. <laughs>